What's good everyone? What a night here at the Moda Center. Final home game before the All-Star break for the Blazers. Final home game over the next three weeks. And boy, did they deliver on a winning note, defeating the defending champion Golden State Warriors by 22 points. Packed house inside the Moda Center. The champs are here. The Golden State Warriors in Rip City. Final game before the All-Star break. Damian Lillard making his fourth All-Star appearance this weekend. Looks like he's ready for the three-point contest too. Knocked down six of them from deep. Finished with 29 points. Al Farouk Aminu, he could have a future in the dunk contest with stuff like that. It was all about the stars for Golden State. Kevin Durant to the top float. He had 32 points. Stephen Curry getting his, he had 32 as well. For Portland, it was a team effort. Eight players scored in double figures, and this game was close. 16 ties, 22 lead changes. Zach Collins brought the energy. Nasty on the rejection. Things getting chippy too. Little brother getting the better of big brother. Seth Curry blows by Steph. Blazers bench chalked up 52 points. Then a huge moment in the fourth quarter. Head coach Steve Kerr doesn't like a call, and he loses it. Ripping into the ref, Kerr was ejected and the Blazers went on a 13-0 run. Portland beats Golden State for the second time this season. Final count, 129-107. We wanted to win this one really bad, um, and it, it, took, it took the whole game uh, to really pull away. Um, and it, was, it was great that we came out on top. It was a big one for us you know, to go in the All-Star break and to, to be confident, you know, knowing to be one of the best teams, if not the best team in the NBA, so uh, it's, it's huge for us. It came down to the last few minutes, and kind of got out of control a little bit you know we, we finished it how we needed to so the blazers improved to 34 and 23 on the season currently in fourth place in the western conference when they get back to work their next seven games will all be on the road but they will have some help moving forward the blazers right before tip-off announcing ennis Cantor has signed with the portland trail blazers for the remainder of this season. He was averaging a double-double with the New York Knicks earlier this season. Cantor is a player that could have an impact on this roster as they make a push towards the playoffs. So the Blazers pick up a new player and a win heading into the All-Star break here at the Moda Center. If you're a Blazers fan, a night to remember here in Rip City. Send it back to you. Boy, listening to you it makes me wish we'd been there. Yeah, how do you? I mean, how do you think they match up against Golden State? Because that's really the team to beat in the West. Those are the champs. That's this is where it all goes through. It's one win. They've got to take it one game at a time. I don't want them to get ahead of themselves when you think about that. But it proves that they do match up well against the Golden State Warriors. But for most. Blazers fans at this point, they want to see results come the postseason. They've lost 10 playoff games in a row. So maybe this is the year that that all ends and having the addition of Ennis Cantor helps them out and getting over the hump into the second round of the postseason. Fingers like crossed. Yeah. Thanks, Thank Orlando. You. We'll be right back.